more bash, but at least nearly got as much TV. I think that reserve is going to be better than the inducements would have been. So, let's see what he's got. Two mighty blows, some block. <laughs> this is where Chaos really don't look good when they've got some block. And dwarves have. <laughs> dwarves are just like, yeah, mate. Can <laughs> five guard, a pommer, three mighty blow. Outrageous. Oh, Pro Prof Strauss. Um, thank you very much. Uh... Oh God! Ignore, <laughs> ignore Tony there. Um, this week's stream, yes, in front of us is I'm gonna I'm gonna take about a week off. I'll be back on Monday the fifth, um, with 1080p and facecam. Ah. Well, you're very welcome. I'm glad. I'm, I'm, I, I still can't believe anybody, anybody watches or appreciates them. So it's, it's always nice when people say that sort of thing. So thanks. <laughs> right. Obviously, receive and crush. Just crush him. Crush him to death. Like they're so chaos are so bad at this level. Unless they've got obviously this TV. They could have a claw palm. Like, you know, they could just get claw, mighty blow, uh, sort of claw and piling on instead of those block guys. And then, then they've got a, then they've got a, actually a good chance to win. So it's not the TV, it's just the level of development isn't, isn't there for him. Talk, oh, come on, get the fuck out. Um, the cross platform, it was two weeks away. It's There's only one game week. The, the first week is. Um, the first week is Xbox versus PC. Second week is PC versus. Uh, the second week is PS4 versus Xbox, and then the final week is PC versus PS4, which presumably will be the big one. I want to get a hmm. Can't get a mighty blow on there, can I? Unless I hit them all this way and then put a guard in and hit them that way. So I, I guess I can. So. Got just enough guard to uh, always be working along the line there. And yeah, I guess he can just come in here. And I've got two dwarves back. Outrageous. He can go there. And then, yeah, he, he just follows. I really want to hit a mighty ball guy, don't I? Oh, and this way, if I get a quick snap, these two can just go forward. He can go forward. He can go forward. Um, they probably don't go forward because there's a warrior there. Oh no, the, the, the cross-platform cup is only the name of the tournament. Um, it is not actually... It isn't actually cross-platform. Um, it is... I should, I should put that in the description of the YouTube video, maybe. Um, the tournament was... You know, it's just... Uh, Yeah, there's no plans to actually have actual cross-platform stuff. Nice that I set up with the uh, quick snap in mind there, wasn't it? That was uh, lucky. Mm, I don't think I want him in contact, seeing there's so much contact all around already. <laughs> oh, Goliath! giant -tastic. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I should put that. In. I'll put that in the description. Uh, all right, so one. He can go there, come back up. So he he'll just stay where he is. The other one. He said something, didn't he? Not a good matchup for me yet. Indeed, <laughs> it's not a good matchup for him.
that's the better square, isn't it? Because then if this is a power... Oh God. <laughs> this is a power I can keep them all in contact. This is a two into a one, but obviously my Dauntless might work. Hey. Piling on to do something for the first time ever? No, he was killed. I have to do this block first, I have to get the assist in. Now to protect the uh, troll slave. Just push into there, I think. Tom Brandhill. Right. You can always go into a cage next turn. Now it's out of field, yeah, crazy, yeah? Absolutely crazy. Tolkan, there's not going to be any Tolkan, sorry. Yeah, it's true, Kovalas, yeah, it is always talking cheese, yeah, it's true. Hello, Nordy or Jolly. Good day, Nick. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> yeah, this turn more damage than last game, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was pretty good, wasn't it? Pretty good. Kazing a beast, KOing a warrior. Still haven't used piling on yet. So actually the following up didn't really matter there because he still did what he would have done anyway. Stand firm. Right. I want to get the Troll Slayer on the Rookie, I guess. He can go around. Right, so get guards in. Piling up and do the foot do something for the first time ever? No. <laughs> Don't be stupid. Can he get in there? Yeah he can. Guard around, that can't be a bad thing. 
You can mighty blow blitz him, but then if I you move him, you can mighty blow blitz somebody anyway, can't you? Maybe just go there. Where can he get to? Base the ball. One, two, three, four, five, six, GFI, GFI. So yeah, that seems good. Let's see, I've just played versus the worst coach in a long time and got a draw. <laughs> I don't know if it was last match, but it was a recent match. Blow there. Putting the runner there's a bit crazy, but he was kind of protected, wasn't he? Too far for the mighty blow to get him, and uh, the warrior just can't hit him because there's guards. <laughs> I jumped up. <laughs> Grab. No. Stand firm does the same thing, doesn't it? With the added bonus of st three stand firm, stopping most uh, most one turns. Yeah, he does have an out of this. There's not, there's not enough guard in there, really. <laughs> Only two. He does that to get out of it completely. Very good. That was a good play, wasn't it? Just done for <laughs> Oh, God. <laughs> I'm just turned into Shawnee. <laughs> oh, brilliant. Uh, can I blitz him? Maybe if I put a guard in there, another player there, block him, and then blitz there. But then I can't stand him up or him up. And I can just chain the mighty blow away there. So. Ooh, this guy is in a bit of danger from getting surfed, though, isn't he? Not if I get a push. Mm. Don't like that. My team's kind of split in half. So he could go one, two, three, four to get this assist in, push him to there and out, and then blitz this mighty blow. If I do that, then these two stay down and moves him over there. Or I'll blitz him with mighty blow, then he's maybe gets a But then it lets me stand up two extra players. I think it's better to stand up two extra players. Just push the mighty blow down your way. Got guard, so it's not so easy to surf him. Pal 
allows him. One, two, three, four, five, six, GFI, GFI, so back one. I wouldn't hate having grab, no. I think they'd be overpowered, in fact, if they started with grab instead of tackle. Long beards. So, I wouldn't hate it. I would just hate paying a skill for it, you know? That's, that's the thing. That is what I would absolutely hate about. And yeah, I realised that once I chained him free. I was like, just means he can blitz my fucking piling on down now, doesn't it? Probably shouldn't have chained him out. Because I could have pushed the warrior there and then the, he'd have been there next to two guards. Got lucky. Was he right to greet it? Maybe. Hey, <laughs> maybe not. <laughs> now this means uh, he's getting pawned, which is glorious, isn't it? Mighty blow hit. Oops. Well, he could. What do you want to guard in there, don't I? Or at least just somebody stopping the assist. One, two, three, four. Ain't gonna happen. So he's gonna have to go there. I fucking knew, I fucking knew it was coming. I thought maybe I should do some safe moves first, seeing as my reroll's gone, you know. One in 12, nine, six, maybe you don't use a, you know, you don't expect to fail, but you should expect to fail one in 36. Maybe I could have, maybe I could have moved some safe moves there. I didn't really, I wanted to see what how it shook out though before I moved the other guy in, you know. Maybe this guy moves in there if I, uh, if I don't pile, then he just blocks. Um, if I did pile, then that guy goes in. So I kind of wanted to see what happened. I forgot Mighty Blow stand firm, but he could also get piling on. And he could also get Fen. So I just, I just would never take grab, basically. It's just, it's just basically impossible to take it. Uh, you'd have to need a long beard to get legend and have <laughs> guard, stand firm, mighty blow, piling on, um, dauntless, fend, and then maybe you can have it seven. Wow, what's going on with these dice, by the way? Two double skulls in one turn for me. Back to back. Oh, no, it was sc double skulls and both down for him. Fucking crazy. At least that guy's not getting surfed this turn. Fucking hell. That's really horrible because that destroyed that situation there, didn't it? With the skills. Kind of quad skills. Hello, Wilking. It was going great after the first turn, but now things have taken a nose dive. That was a brutal, brutal two double scores in one turn. Yeah, lead definitely a leader, yeah, a couple of laps. Yeah. yeah, definitely gonna get a leader. I wonder if I've got a guard on the bench. I would, that would be the sort of thing that I would do. On dice pad.
Got to blitz this guy, haven't I? Yeah, things are going pretty bad, and I'm three men down because of these two. F four men down because of him as well, really. Could one dice him for a push, then two dice him. I mean that that's pretty good if that works. I guess I've got to stand this guy. Up. So stand up both of these, he gets blitzed, and then he gets blocked out. If I stand him up, he gets blitzed and then blocked out. I go for the dodge, probably fails, but next turn. Hmm. I just don't re go for this and don't reroll it. He needs an assist here though, so him surfing him stops him making a, I guess he'd just do a one dice blitz. So yeah, he's got to stand up, because he's got a blitz, it's actually a bit of work to surf that one. And it stops him using assists in other places, so it's not so bad. I didn't move far enough, did I? Didn't, literally didn't move him. I moved him to here and then didn't move him. Oh my god, I've got a GFI now. Oh my god, that's so fucking bad. Oh, for fuck's sake. This is the problem with fucking talking instead of just playing. <laughs> it does make things harder. Shit. Wow, insta, insta reroll for the serve. That was... Some would say ballsy. Some would say stupid. <laughs> I'll let I'll let you decide. <laughs> oh, Dougie. Yeah, that was horrible. I'd thought about moving him to there and I thought, no, I won't move him that far, I'll just move him to like here. And then just didn't move him. Yeah, but now he's got no reroll. Hmm. Oh, he doesn't have block, fair enough. Still, not not good to use your last reroll then, is it? But yeah, I guess fair enough. Would have been a turnover. Fair enough. Not so crazy. Oof. So many players down with it, these stuns and these these guys being out of the action. It's pretty rough. Free double play, that was nice of him. Come on, you gotta fail this three plus. Right. I can put a guard in there, blitz him, get the ball over the halfway line.
Guess what's gonna happen now? Yes, it's another panning on failure. Right, he's on just a three plus. I'm on a three plus to tag him and make things a bit safer. Oh god, he can just blitz us here. Oh Christ. There's a guard there though. So you can only hit us from double guard. So that's actually this is actually a safe spot, isn't it? You can only hit me from double guard. Or potentially one guard. One dice block has a bigger payoff than a dodge. Then we'll pill surf him. Yeah, might. Knight as well. Four, five, six GFI. So he's got to cancel that somehow. Same with him. Alright. Oof, fucking hell. <laughs> oh, God, Goliath. <laughs> Sandfern wouldn't have been used probably ever. But guard, you know, but then he, I, I want him down. He's, at least he's not getting hit by mighty blow, you know, a lot of the time. But, you know, he, just because he's rolling badly these six games, <laughs> however many it is, he's had batting on and done nothing. However many games it is without him doing anything. Um, it doesn't mean it was the wrong decision, does it? Double fives. First skill up on a one reroll. What? Is it like Woody's or? It's crazy. A double five, probably guard. I don't know, guard's really good, isn't it? No, oh, stand firm. Right, I think I've got, I've got an advance down the other side, haven't I? Yeah, he gets the serve. That's good because that's a waste of his time, maybe. Yeah, of course, it's a castle. Isn't it? I guess I don't have point. Because I've, I've already got 13 players, so it's not so bad. I think that was a mistake by him. Um, he can push him out of the way, can blitz him, and block him. Ooh, you can block him actually. Block him to there. Blitz him to there. Block him, and then one, two. Yeah, I've got to block these two. I could potentially block him, but then the push just looks horrible, doesn't it? If he blitz, how, do, how can he block? Mm, just the push is horrible, then I can use the blitz later. Give us a guard in there. I suppose to him just going, where do he go? One, two, three, four, five, six. And then he 2D him. And then he just potato. One, two, three, four, five, six. GFI. Doesn't look good, whatever I do, does it really? 
He could blitz, but then he's no. He's got to stand up. Yeah, because then I haven't got guard, but now I can block him. I've got guard in. <laughs> or not. No, that's where I wanted to go, isn't it? I've completely fucked my. completely fucked my own asshole now. Surf, no touchdown. Yeah, exactly, Emperor Augustus, exactly, yeah. He can still score here, can't he? <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> it's funny how the first turn was great, and then after that, I got out-positioned out, out and uh, just played shit, really. To be fair, I've just played bad. You can say that I rolled bad. Which would be true. <laughs> but uh, still just played that, I guess. Yeah, it was the double scores, yeah, that was a killer, wasn't it? That really was a killer. Because that was the diff that was what got me into all this trouble over there, as opposed to them just using their guard to block people and get back nearer. Mm. Yeah, maybe that was the maybe the quad scores. Yeah, I mean, it wasn't technically quad skulls in all in a row, but on the same turn it was. Um, it was essentially quad skulls, wasn't it? I didn't know if that was a good idea or not. I thought it might be. Probably irrelevant. Yeah, the Trolls Lair has... It's amazing how consistently poorly he's rolled. <laughs> Crazy, really. That, that a player can roll that bad. Protecken, Protecken is a... Mighty Blow guy there from the uh, follow-up block. Which is what I was going to do. I was going to go one, two... Th three, four, put him there so that I could have blitzed and then got the assist on the follow up. Wrong direction. <laughs> yep. Could have scored. Could have scored. But it, yeah, protected him. Brown's going to go for the. Uh, the two into one. Fuck it. What would a dwarf do? This.
<laughs> you probably won't believe me, but it's true. <laughs> it's damn true. Holy shit. Gia fighter hit without mighty blow, I don't think we'll go for that. <laughs> Fucking hell. <laughs> The troll slayer, he finally did something. Oh, he could have got that earlier, couldn't he? Can't believe he stopped the score with zero rerolls just by both being slow. Well, but then that was my fault. I should have moved him forward about three or four squares that turn, and if I had, wouldn't have had to make any GFIs and then would have succeeded. So, of course, he stays out. No, he stays out as well. That's pretty good then. So this is 8 versus 9. Got half a chance. Protect the AV8. No, he's got nine. Oh, ten versus nine. Duh. Fucking hell. Ten versus nine. Ten versus nine. Nine versus ten. <laughs> he's written it as well. <laughs> oh, Christ. <laughs> Bob's good. Well, I, I did get quad skulls, to be fair. But yeah, it feels bad after the first, which was a crucial one, really, because th those three there were about to sort themselves out, and the double skull stunned him and completely isolated the other two, instead of maybe stunning his guy and getting them two back in the fight. So it really was huge, never mind the rest of the turn, which wasn't really like it produced much. Um, because I just forgot. Just because I forgot a crazy lemur. Literally, literally the only reason. Hmm, it's got the wall, ball in case, what are you? Just you wait, just you wait. Eventually, one day, you'll do something good and you'll be like, oh, well done. Well done. Piling on, who would have thought piling on's actually amazing? You know, eventually that will happen. One game, it'll actually be good. I'll do a Murloc Joe impression and it will just kill everything. That's true, Ducky, yes, that's it. Right. God is amazing, to be fair. But you don't want it on a fucking armor 8 guy, do you? Like on this team, he'd be so targeted. And Frenzy as well, he's just, you know, I don't think it's the right choice for a Troll Slayer. But you can argue that a Troll Slayer isn't a good choice. But he gives you a bit more movement as well. On a team that's sorely lacking movement, so I don't hear that. Him. 
hin. He can protect the sideline a bit. Come on, luxury player. Prove your worth. Break armor? Maybe? Maybe? Wow, twice in one game. The worst of both worlds. Yeah, that's a good idea in Protocol, because that's probably a good idea for every every human being who plays Blood Bowl to do, isn't it? No, he just changed this guy away. I didn't realise he was there. That was fucking stupid. Wasn't it? I literally didn't even see. Oh, that's horrible. Horrible and the guard should have been here. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Yeah, I could have just taken the mighty blow blitz here, yeah. Yes, Jelly, that's very true, yeah, Necro is just shit bash. Unless they r r roll well, yeah, absolutely. That sums up Necro quite well. <laughs> they just shit bash unless they roll good. <laughs> and they're amazing. Yeah. Got a GFI to hit with Mighty Blow, so I guess it's done. Maybe I'll blitz with Pong. He could blitz him. Probably not a bad idea, is it? He got blocked. Should have pushed him in there. Fuck. If he wants to blitz over here, he might get himself into trouble here. Maybe he could go there. Let's go back a bit, I guess. Play it safe.
just stood them up. Good. Good. Things get a bit tricky for him now, don't they? Just blitz to get a two dice block. <laughs> Fucking dwarves. out over here. Very bad turn. Just scold after saying that, shouldn't he? I'd have been happy with that. Right. Um, maybe this guy can get free. One, two, three, four, five. And this guy can get free, and I could one dice the ball. That seems like something that could happen. I could just push him away. No, I need a power here. I guess this fails now. No hit on the ball. We can two dice him. He could two dice him.
Lame can 2D him, could 1D him, could 2D him, could 1D the ball. <sighs> I'm blitzed, have I? Haven't blitzed. So I could blitz there, then block there, and then just shore it up for next turn. He hasn't got anyone behind, so making this a two dice is uh, decent, I think. That's guard, isn't it? But this is guard, stun firm. Yeah, I think probably better to put him there. Nice stun that, wasn't it? Actually, that let me get that extra one on. Still got plenty of time, five turns. <laughs> well, Jelly hasn't got sound on, but Stand Firm as it was, was incredibly strong. And I think if you made Stand Firm that strong again, it would, uh, yeah, it would be crazy. It's not easy for him to potato, though, is it? Like, this this guy's uh, behind the lines. So, like, there's furthest four players on here, so it's not easy for him to potato, really. And he's still, you know, he's behind him. So, it's going to be tough for him to potato. Just get a smooth Kaz, though. I'll bash to death here. As you'd expect, of course, um, a team with armor 9 facing somebody with only two mighty blows who haven't been able to hit for half the game um, has taken two cars with an apple fail. And he's taken. After the first turn, he's taken nothing. Basically. Until turn 12. Turn 1 and 12 are the only removals. <laughs> Ah, the old stand firm was ridiculous. It was if you failed a dodge, you didn't fall over. You just stood up in the square you were dodging from. You stayed standing in the square you were dodging from. It was ridiculous. Me, boo. about the potato. Do I do the three plus dodge? First, because then I could hit him and then he could blitz. No, one, two, three, four, five, it's better to do it. Don't say anything for it except this desperation move. 
it wasn't a turnover, no, and no armor roll. No, it was a square you dodge from to stop it being completely ridiculous, wasn't it? Or was it? I thought it was one you were from because otherwise you could just get into a cage and you couldn't be stopped getting into a cage. I thought it was one way you no, it was where you from. It was where it was where you went from. Pretty sure it was where you went from. Because you would just try to dodge into things and if it failed, you didn't matter. You know, try to dodge away from somebody and if it failed, you didn't dodge away from them. So yeah, it was where you where you were dodging from. And you it was insane. It was absolutely insane. Right, I've got to do this dodge. Obviously, got to use a reroll on the dodge. And fail this, and it's all over, basically. Pretty perfect result. One dice into a two dice. Come on, troll slow. I don't think in the original third ed rules I don't think it had that aspect in Brit Augustus I think that aspect developed later on um, I've got a feeling but I can't remember I, I'm in, in Living Rule Book 4 it was absolutely the square they were dodging from because it was a trait then so I think they buffed they buffed it because it was a trait um, maybe they didn't know wasn't it wasn't a skill I ever cared about in third edition, I know that. I went the ball down because I just thought get get my troll slayer close to the ball. Well glad I didn't re-roll it. <laughs> Would have been frustrated. Chip at this that it's been it's been essentially one or two mighty blows versus armor nine and then three mighty blow plus a pawn against armor eight has done nothing. It's fucking crazy. No, I didn't Stay on him. Not afraid to do the one dices, is he? He could J fight to get up to here. And you could blitz him. You could also double J fighter there, that doesn't seem worth it. One dice with him. For a push. And he could block him. He could GFI, so he could two dice in one uphill. That seems fucking horrific.
could stun him up, he could double geofire to hit him. He could dodge to surf him, no I can't even surf him. He can just blitz away here, well, I guess he's got to worry about the ball. Could double GFI and then it's a two in or one. He could just stand up, he could 2D. He could double GFI so he could 2D, face the ball. He could 1D. GFI there, then he 2Ds him. Ooh, that's better, isn't it? And then the troll slur is free. Maybe that's even better. I don't know what the troll slur actually does with his new freedom. One dice is the ball, maybe. It is. I get the surf as well if I'm lucky. <laughs> Not bad. <laughs> Not a bad turn. <laughs> uh, I mean, he can two dice the ball easily. Um, there's no way for me to protect against that. I don't want to do one dice, I'd rather him roll the dice. Even though his dice are two dice. <laughs> no, it doesn't doesn't get the budge the fucking stamp the stamp firm's been awesome in this game in stark contrast to uh in stark contrast to piling on stand firm has been instantly amazing Ooh, didn't get the pal. Ah, but he, he made the right block anyway, so... Didn't really matter. Three turns with a re-roll. Runner almost in the right spot. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Ah, shit. Scatter. Excellent. Excellent. Oh god. Going pretty well. This this is this guy's a problem. Maybe actually a block there. Then troll slayer, because I have to keep him marked. I have to stand up, I have to blitz into somebody. 
So he could blitz, and then he could go one, two, three, four, five, six, and he could block him. I mean, it's dodgy for where the where the runner goes, isn't it? To keep it safe. He could block him and not follow. And then put him in between here. One, two, three, four, five. I don't like leaving him. I think this one's the play. No, oh, but then just leave him there anyway, so he just blocks. That's disappointing. This has to be him now, but then this keeps him covering the sideline, which is alright, isn't it? One, two, three. So actually, that worked out pretty well in the end. One, two, three, four. I don't know why he goes after that. Ah, fuck. Two GFIs now. Fucking scary. Hello, Crystal Hunter. Um, yeah, but probably... Probably only gonna play them once I'm back in Germany so that I'll have 15 seconds to use my apothecary. <laughs> That might actually be better than just having the ball. <laughs> having it there. Maybe that was a better spot to keep them. Actually, maybe that's where I should have gone with the ball there. Ah, no, it's still just a dodge to hit him. No. This was, this was the right square, I'm pretty sure. Come on. Shit. Nah, yeah, it was definitely better to stand there. Oh, double scold! <laughs> oh, man. Look a noob or what? Wow. This up so bad. <sighs> Literally, I had to fucking do that to get him in scoring range. Now he's got to make a GFI. So that's still got a scoring threat. In case I fail the one in nine. Really fucked it up for myself here. Fuck's sake. One, two, three, four, five, six. GFI, GFI. Keeps it a screen. I guess this is the play anyway. So if I fail, if I fail the pickup, I'm just done.
Oh, thank God. I have to make one GFI now. One, two, three, four, five, six. Might as well make it now. One, two, three, four, five. GFI, GFI. So he's looking at four, four, three. He's looking at three, four, five, six. GFI, GFI. So he can't even hit anyway. So. Let's go there. Just because I can. I say just because I can, just because I've got two re rolls left. So he just got fucked by the dice there, didn't he, with that double score, I guess. So that kind of equals my quad score, I guess. Sounds like a show meeting. When the blitzer gets your hands it and drop the river. <laughs> so you can blitz that guy and then base the ball. <laughs> um, or you can go four four three. Double GFI. Oh, thank God. Thanks, TLC. Whoo! Scary. You too. Um, three, four, five, six. Can't make it. Seven. He can come back. So he can punch him. He can punch him. He can punch him with a blitz. Oh, because he's got a panning on, so he's not going to do that. So he, he wants to blitz. No, the next one wants to blitz. Alright. No, he wanted a blitz. Yeah. Mm. He wanted a blitz, then it's just that one. Never mind. Hey, it did something. <laughs> it did something. It made a stun. Right, obviously just more chance of star player points hitting armor rate. Right? It is nil nil though. I'll risk the one in twelve nine six. Although there is a non zero percent chance of me just taking the skull. <laughs> that isn't good. Yeah, the troll slayer was quite a decent second half, yeah. He did, he uh he made a crucial stun, he made some KOs, he made some KOs. He hasn't made a Kaz, but he made a couple of, in the second half particularly, he, he set up a, uh, he made a crucial stun which set up a surf. So, just for fun, Soul Forge BB really. Yeah, he actually was, he actually was really good, yeah. Yeah, to be fair. No, I fucking pressed OK instead of reroll. For fuck's sake, I'm an idiot. Um, 16 AV bricks to 5. Yeah, he made two cars and a KO that didn't return, so he did. He got pretty good value from his AV bricks. So I was whining about not getting the removals in the first half. Got some late on. Um, but yeah, obviously made a lot of stuns, which I guess helped. Helped. It's easy to cry about not getting removals, but then if you make a lot of uh, stuns, that should be enough, shouldn't it? Uh, 
So yeah, two missed next games. So eleven players for the next game, and not enough players to buy, not enough money to buy anyone. So missing two of the best players, being God Mighty Blow guys, <laughs> and only eleven guys, two of which are runners. That's uh, that's disappointing. And I didn't re-roll. Mm. Didn't re-roll the winnings. Tried and failed to re-roll the winnings. Right. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And stay fantastic.